Me. This is me. Broken and shattered, my mind is in splinters. Can't you hear the voices, their melancholy melodies? Alone with the shadows, hidden with the figures. These doctors and medicines won't help me, nor will these therapies. Scars on my wrists, wounds of the last battle. My mind is the killer, hauntingly creative and disturbingly dark. I am late for the meeting with the darkness at a chapel. To be as one forever in eternity, he has left his mark. Distorted voices tell the truths. He lies, don't believe him. I guess maybe I should listen to these voices, for all they know is truth. Or maybe I should listen to the others, rip him, tear him limb from limb. They show me the lies of this mortal, and they have the proof. Should I give them more credit? Maybe I should allow them control. If I was to, maybe, then they would show me all I need to know. For death is the last and only thing on my list, my only goal. So me, just skipping ahead, shouldn't hurt anyone. I wouldn't care though. These shadows have led me to the edge. It is now up to me to take the step to become the food of zombies and ghouls. To the devil, I shall bow to my knee. For a creator so dark, he needs a love, but someone who will follow his rules. I shall never disobey him. He was there when God had abandoned. As were the shadows and the beings, those not of this world. They accept me. They know my intentions. They love me through all that has happened. And I shall follow them to the edge of the earth into the heaven where we were hurled. Our wings have become ripped and destroyed, torn and frayed, for we are alone. We are the ones left behind, enemy of the damned. We are the one with the devil. Of the darkness, we are never afraid, for we are the new angels, bloodthirsty and in command. We are the rulers of this wretched land.